Li tea, along with choka, is a complete meal originated from the Indian subcontinent, and popular in Indian states of Bihar, Jharkhand, parts of eastern Uttar Pradesh as well as Nepalese state of Madesh. It is a dough ball made up of whole wheat flour and stuffed with satu roasted chickpea flour mixed with herbs and spices and then roasted over coal or cow dung cakes or wood then it is tossed with lots of ghee. Although very often confused with the closely related bati, it is a completely different dish in terms of taste, texture and preparation. It may be eaten with yogurt, baigan barda, aloo barda, and papad. The li tea are traditionally baked over a cow dung fire, but in the modern day a new fried version has been developed. Herbs and spices used to flavor the li tea include onion, garlic, ginger, coriander leaves, lime juice, carom seeds, nigella seeds, and salt. Tasty pickles can also be used to add spice flavor. In western Bihar and eastern Uttar Pradesh li tea is served with merg korma a creamy chicken curry or choka a vegetable preparation of roasted and mashed eggplant, tomato, and potato. See also Bihari cuisine li tea is a staple food of Bihar, Jharkhand and Uttar Pradesh. It is made of whole wheat flour and stuff with satu gram flour powder. Cooking and serving of li tea is very important to realize the actual taste of this food. Best litis should be cooked in low fire of cow dung cake. The taste of liti lies on its stuffed material i.e., satu. Dry satu is mixed with chopped garlic and ginger and some Indian dry species to give a tangy flavor. <laughs>